Well, in sad news, India has now stepped up effort to get mountaineer Mastan Babu's body back to India. The celebrated mountaineer was found dead in his tent in the Andes on Friday. He was 40. Efforts to bring back the body to India could not succeed due to adverse climatic conditions. The MEA has already spoken to the Indian Commission in Argentina and Chile. Parliamentary Affairs Minister Venkaya Naidu spoke to External Affairs Minister Sushma Swaraj. The centre will bear all expenses for retrieving the body of mountaineer Mastan Babu. The only two options available to recover the body are either to press Augusta Westland helicopters that can land on the mountain range into service or to deploy a team of 11 expert mountaineers for bringing the body. The government has attributed renewed urgency to bring back the body after Mali Mastan Babu's mother spoke to Venkaya Naidu. I want to go across to my colleague Maha Siddiqui tracking the latest details coming in from the Ministry of External Affairs. Maha, can you give us more details on how the MEA has now intervened to speed and hasten the process of bringing back the body? Yes, absolutely. India has stepped up efforts to retrieve the body of uh, Mastan Babu from the Chilean side of the Andes. In fact, earlier on, his friends had been collecting funds from across the world for efforts to look for him. After his body was traced on the Chilean side of the Andes, uh, uh, those funds were going to be utilized, in fact, to retrieve the body. But after uh, the mother of uh, Mastan Babu spoke with uh, Union Minister Venkaya Naidu this morning, uh, expressing her desire desire to uh, for a speedy retrieval of the body and for the body to come back to India as soon as possible. Venkaya Naidu uh, spoke to External Affairs Minister Sushma Swaraj who in turn then spoke and directed the missions both in Argentina and Chile that uh, no efforts should be spared in retrieving the body and has also said that the central government is going to bear the entire cost of this operation. Remember so far Preeti the body has not been uh, they have not been able to retrieve the body because of the inclement weather conditions and the only two options available are the ones that you just mentioned of either an Augusta Westland helicopter landing in that area or 11 expert mountaineers going there and retrieving the body. All right, appreciate you joining us, Maha. We're going to keep coming back to you for further updates on that story. All right, uh, we have Mali Mastan's sister on the phone line with us. Appreciate you talking to us, ma'am, and uh, we do offer our condolences in this time of grief. Uh, uh, have you been able to speak? I believe you did speak to Mr. Wankhaya Naidu, and he has promised all cooperation. Ma'am, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Ma'am, I believe, uh, first, we're extremely sorry. We do offer our condolences in this time of grief. Uh, have you, you've, I believe you've spoken to Mr. Vankaya Naidu and he has promised all cooperation to you to bring back the body of your brother. Yes, he, uh, a couple of hours ago, uh, Vankaya Naidu has called up and he informed me that from the government of India, they have already informed the embassies, both at Chile and the Argentina uh, um, embassies, and informed and uh, said that they has they will do all the possible uh, things to bring back my brother um, and uh, through the armed uh, heli uh, uh, aircraft or me or me helicopters if they could not succeed with that uh, it seems they are going to hire nine or ten people uh, for the cost of $100,000, which our Indian government has accepted uh, on behalf of the Indian government to pay for the Chilean or Argentinian government to do the work and to bring back my brother as soon as possible. Have you been given a time frame, ma'am, as to when this operation would be possible? Well, uh, I, he did not say uh, anything about that when and uh, um, when, but he said the uh, uh, it will be done. But when? Uh, uh, as soon as possible. That is the answer I got. And when I spoke to our uh, Indian ambassador based at Chile, he said that tomorrow morning they are going to get an order from the governor of Argentina 
and once they receive the orders they will fly the uh, army commanders uh, to see the possibilities of getting my brother on board and bringing ha- bringing him back to base camp and from there uh, um, through the helicopters will be brought to Santiago and then to Mendoza from here he will be uh, flying to India appreciate you joining us ma'am in the suburb of grip uh, thank you for talking to headlines today